Not yet. I've got a plan. Huh. What are we looking at? This creature is known as a saber tusk. It skewers prey with its tusks, extracting game from the safety and comfort of burrows. That's a bit hardless. And easy. Close it out, Clyde. Here goes nothing! <laughs> oh, yeah! Hey, who's out there? Well, and look who's in here. The man of the hour. Dave, right? <laughs> Been looking for you. Yeah. <laughs> Didn't mean to cause y'all any trouble. I've been stuck here on account of my sprained ankle. Yeah, something funny about them varmints. I gave them hell, but couldn't finish the job. Still one mean mud about. Well, y'all don't look much like hunters, but what do you say? Put that puppy to rest for me? Oh, yeah, we'll take care of it. Y'all got guts, that's for sure. Let me tell you where I last saw. Way to show some spunk. Now let's get ready to kick some tail. I've been hunting for years, but I ain't never seen dual horns with blood-red tusks like those. to rest up before we set out. In that case, let's find a spot to make camp. The hunters are really out in full force around here, huh? So they're the new Crown's Guard or something? Similar, though technically a civilian outfit. They've definitely seen a lot more action than we have. Uh, is it cool that we rock Crown's Guard outfits? Be worse not to. They made them especially for us. Even got a sweet insignia on them. In the Crown's Guard, your attire identifies you. So wear it with pride. You want to make camp? Sleeping out under the stars tonight.
I likes. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Nailed it. This should be a hit. Look at you. Yeah, I know. Why you gotta be so photogenic? Like a father to her. Ever since they got back, Sid's been the only one looking after her. Rather more than a middling mechanic can handle. All things considered, I'd say she turned out okay. Well, like any girl, you just need to treat her right. Over there! That's it, right? Huh. That's a dual horn? Yes, but not your run-of-the-mill breed. We'd best make quick work of it. Too. Things vicious. You sure? Looks tame to me. Yeah. Look out! <laughs> yeah! Show those oh, Nice one. It's not over yet. <laughs> Ready for round two this time. Bring it. Oh, yeah! Shut up! Pronto! Make it count! Yep. For where? Ring, ring. Hello? Hey, Dave just called and said he's safe. Thanks for finding him. Ken? Nice work, y'all. By the way, the old girl's looking good as new. Oh, while I got you. If y'all want to fix her up before you roll out, let me know. Sounds good. She'll be waiting at the garage. Gotcha. So, who's up next behind the wheel? Ignis should take it and never let go. It helps that he can keep four eyes on the dash. <laughs> I couldn't even keep one. Not sure I'd do any better. Put me in the driver's seat. Good. Because I need the legroom in back.
It's rude to keep a girl waiting. You better apologize. Uh, uh, what is that? A live hurricane. That thing's like half bird, half storm, half airship. You realize that's three halves. Would explain its size. <laughs> awesome in every sense. You saved me. Thank you. I'd call that a job well done. Rather sultry. Yeah. We're here. Sorry about the wait. Ain't she pretty? She's almost too pretty for the road. She's back! We should all get a picture with her. All the more reason to ride with care. Oh, and before I forget, would y'all mind making a little delivery for me? No, not at all. Perfect. Thought you'd say yes. So I already put it in the trunk. There should be a motel on your way to Galden. If y'all wouldn't mind giving that to the owner, that'd be swell. Grandpa like grandkid. Now that she's all polished up and ready for the road, would you care to take her for a little test drive, Noct? Sure. Why not? And I needn't remind you to exercise caution. Well, here's what I can do for her. How about the decals? Go on, pick a color. Anything you like? How about the decals? How's this? I'll polish her up nice for you. Well, here she is, just like you ordered. Time to go. Mm
Hammerhead is like no garage ever. You know? One would expect no less of purveyors to the crown. Ah, <sighs> I'll miss it once this road trip's over with. Huh? There's no reason you can't pay them a visit anytime you please. I'm sure Cindy will be glad to look after your car. Oh, right. So, that's what this is about. If you need, I could always lend you the regalia. Whoa! <laughs> Uh, yeah, thanks for the offer, but once we're back in the Crown City, I think I'd better score my own wheels. So that's far enough for today. Might be wise to leave the driving to me until we found our bearings out here. Y'all came all the way out here to deliver the goods. Well, thank you kindly. We'll take it out of the trunk so y'all just sit tight. Hmm? Uh, Umbra, you're bringing us stuff. Atta boy. A dog can really track a scent. Certainly knows how to find us. How do you always know, boy? <sighs> just a sec.
nice flower. It's the same kind we sewed our crowns from. Oh yeah, sill blossoms. So, hmm? I have a favor to ask. Take the notebook with you when you go. Sure. That's not all. I want you to put something in the book and send it back. All set. Take care out there. I know. You're not gonna tell me. Then don't ask. What was that about? <sighs> you don't say.